So to begin with, we were going to start with pneumatics. We were going to have the hook sitting on a piston and the hook, it was going to kind of act similar. Um, we would raise the piston up, have the hook sit on there. And then when the piston would lower, it would kind of be the same, same kind of concept where the hook would slide off with the winch. Uh, we kind of came to the conclusion that pneumatics wouldn't be the best option and we didn't really have the space for it or the time to really go through and run it. So we kind of had to switch up with our whole mounting system. And that's where we, you know, we, we knew that we had a bunch of two by one left. So we just kind of put stuff together and came up with this. So this is our little hook for our climb. And this hook, uh, we have this little kind of sleeve mechanism that we have it attached to the hook and then this end of the part is cut out. So this will slide on a two, two by one piece of tubing. And basically once we drive onto the chain, we're gonna drive forward, the hook will be there, drive backwards, and then this whole part will fall off and then there will be a winch attached to the hook that will pull the robot out. How we designed it was we knew that if the part that needed to slide onto the two by one, we knew um, we knew that part and then we needed to, to figure out the angle that we had to kind of make this little slope part and we figured that out from our whole elevator shooter mechanism um, that was at about like a 54 degree angle before it, it got moved changed not sure what it's at now but we we based it off of that because we wanted um, our two by one to stick out like that have this be right on there and then have the hook be facing up like 